Welcome to Business Connection. I'm Liz Spencer. I have a wonderful guest in studio. It's Matt Peterson. He's VP of Business Development for Idyllis. And if you're a small business owner, you're going to want to pay attention to this. Welcome. Tell me a little bit about what Idyllis does. Well, thank you for having me. Idyllis is a PEO, which is a professional uh, employer organization. And what PEOs do is they provide benefits, payroll, and human resource support for small businesses. Okay. Idyllis specializes in small business from about 1 to 100. Okay. We have a specific program for sole proprietors, which makes us unique. And we, what we really do is we provide that high-touch service platform for our small employer groups, provide them a Fortune 100 benefit package that they can't really access with the regular insurance mechanisms. No, but and that's, that's a very comprehensive answer, but what you really do is you give small business owners a lot of help when it comes to HRN and employee relations. We are the back office for, for yep. small employer groups. Really, you know, it's challenging for small employer groups to go out and navigate benefits, navigate all the regulations that surround human resources, navigate the compliance with payroll. You're absolutely right. I mean, we all want to do the right thing for our employees. And but, we help you do that. We right, really help you do that. Right, because it changes too much. I, I don't, you know, I, I'm the executive director, but, you know, I, I need help because I just, that's not my focus. Regulatory compliance is more complicated now than it ever has been in the history of business. And really what the employers do is they struggle with keeping pace with the changes. You've got health care reform, and you've got reform across the EEOC. They're constantly putting new uh, regulations out there. And what we do with our HR folks is we keep you compliant and we keep you up to date with all those changes. And one of the neat things uh, when we were talking off camera that I thought was interesting is that the HR component in insurance, and we talk about compliance, is, sometimes I don't think we even know if we're in or out of compliance, and, yeah. mm -hmm. but the insurance is complicated. And if you're a small group, it's hard to get good insurance because our numbers don't make any give us any leverage whatsoever. Well, and that's, that's a great point. So what we do is we can, we can provide a high-end benefit platform a comprehensive integrated benefit platform that gives access to insurance plans and networks that you can't get on the open exchange a small business goes out and tries to find you know I'm a group of five people and I want to have you know insurance for my folks but I can't get a policy that I really want at a cost that I can get at the deductible levels we want. What I do is I put all of these small groups together. I go out and I get insurance plans and leverage the rates with the carriers, get the better plans, and provide you with a much better insurance uh, program, comprehensive insurance program, program for your employees. But then we professionally administer those benefits. So it's really just a handoff to us. And it works really well for employer groups because my employees don't come to me and say, I have an explanation of benefits that I don't understand. Can you help me with it? The business owner doesn't have time to really run that down, nor do they really have the competency to do it correctly. Right. Absolutely. Those are hard questions. So very hard. And so what we do is we do all of that for you. So we really are a pick-up and plug-in HR and benefit administration backbone. We don't sell insurance. That's not our business. Okay. Our business is really providing a better service platform for our small business groups. Well, and I think when you start out as a small business, you know, you, you might be by yourself or, you know, you might have a couple people. And then as you grow, you realize, wow, I have employees. I care about them. I want them to do well. And then you realize benefits help you retain them, too, which is, I think, when we start that's looking a, at you and saying, yeah, help wow, us. Yeah, that's, that's such an important thing. So retention, attract, attracting good employees, skilled employees, and then retention. More and more, now more than ever in in, in the business environment, employees shop jobs for benefits. Mm -hmm. and, and when you can offer that Fortune 100 opportunity for them, a, a comprehensive benefit package that's a high-level benefit package, you're going to attract better employees, you're going to retain the, the quality employees that you have. And it really is a win-win. Well, and we were also talking off camera that, that benefits and companies like you, yours have really changed in the last two or three decades that you know previous it, we were all worried about workman's compensation and now we're more worried on we're more concerned on the administration side because we have figured out that our employees and their benefits are a major asset 
Well, that's and it's, it's human capital, mm -hmm. right? So you mm -hmm. take care of your human capital. Mm -hmm. And the other side of that, too, is compliance problems. And, and, and they go kind of marry hand in hand. Mm -hmm. Staying compliant, keeping your business out of trouble. Most of the small businesses want to do the right thing all the time. It's <laughs> yeah. hard to know what you don't know. Right. And what we provide is that backbone for you. We, if you have a problem, you pick up the phone and you call. We have certified HR people. They're all PHRs, which is a professional uh, human resource designation. We have certified payroll people. We keep you compliant with payroll. We keep you compliant with human resources. And your employees can, can call us if they have problems that they want to walk through. Okay, we really are a partner for you, so that we can provide you with that that backbone and make you feel comfortable with with where you are in compliance and, and help your employees navigate the benefit market. Well, I think that word partner is really important because for a small business owner, you need to be able to say, okay, go talk to Matt and, and he can answer your question so I can go close this deal. Well, and, and that's, that's, so who's the best closer in the business? The owner. They're the owner. They, they, they've, they've, brought, they've established the business, and they're the ones that do the, the, the heavy lifting on the closing. Mm -hmm. So your employees, you know, I, so many times I talk to small employer groups, and, and the employers, the, the owners involved with uh, payroll or doing the HR themselves or, or you know, handling some of the, the uh, administrative duties that they could offload, free up their time to develop their business and build it. Mm -hmm. And really, that's what, who we are, is we're a partner in that respect. We allow you to, to go out and build your business. We'll handle all of the stuff that really maybe isn't your comfort zone or your real core competency. Well, I think you have an advantage, too, because you kind of came out of the medical field. Tell that's, us a yeah, little, so tell I, like us a little to, I like to tell this story. You know, yeah. We were talking earlier. Um, so Idealis really started about 13 years ago, and we've always been a Naperville area company. We um, started out as a medical consulting group doing you know, practice formations for physicians, um, integration issues with hospitals, uh, mergers, acquisitions, that kind of stuff. And what came out of that is our physician groups came to us and said, Idealis, can you help me? I'm having a hard time with my payroll with my benefits in HR. I mean, managing my employees is difficult for me. And so what we decided to do was start doing that as a value add to our clients. Well, we did a pretty good job, and so serendipitously, they were referring all of their physician practice friends to us and, and um, accountants and attorneys, all the you know different companies mm -hmm. that revolve around medical practices, and the business just started growing on its own. So... <laughs> Really what happened about six years ago is it had started outpacing our medical consulting revenue. We decided, well, I think we have something here. So we split the business off and really just took it out to the market and opened it up to other businesses. It's been growing since then. It's really just been growing and growing. We still have very special relationships with our clients mm -hmm. and we still value those relationships so we've grown and we've really grown in a controlled way and it's and we've managed to keep our personality and our relationship with our clients and those are so important to us they're absolutely and matt talking to you i can see where your passion is for that and i appreciate that thanks for stopping by business connection thank you so much thanks for the time today and we're going to be right back with more business connection stay tuned